was rough, <laughs> really rough. I, mean, I was in a dark place and I saw no way out. I really didn't know what we were going to do. I certainly couldn't take another minute of it. I was literally getting sick to my stomach. I mean, oh, you, you saw how bad it got. I mean, it was worse than anyone could imagine, and well, we, we started to grow apart because of it. I mean, I mean it got to the point where we, we couldn't even get to sleep at night. He couldn't cook for s. I couldn't cook for s. I was at my wit's end. I was seriously about to break up with him. But then a friend told me about Jason and his um his inspirational book and and I figured it couldn't hurt to check it out, right? As soon as I got Lauren's letter, I knew she needed my help. She was telling me that the bitch just couldn't cook worth shit. When it came to cooking, Jake was as confused as a blind lesbian in a fish market. I kept telling Lauren, you know, I am as confused as a blind lesbian in a fish market. Something, something needs to be done. I am not going through this again. When someone comes to me in their darkest hour and tells me I don't know how to cook, I don't like it, and I don't have the time, I simply sit them down, I look them in the eye, and I say, you, get in the kitchen, bitch. I was just so tired of all the sweet and cheerful chefs. It made me just wanna smack them in the face with a frying pan. I knew I had to write a book that cut through all the crap. I needed to help those bitches out there that were starving. No, hungering for something more. It was my mission. It was my duty. It was my reason for living. I'm not gonna coddle you, hold your hand, or even tell you that you look hot in apron. I'm not your mama, sweetheart. I'm your daddy. I don't care if you're black, white, Latino, Asian, gay, straight, bisexual, a hermaphrodite, if you're male, if you're female, if you're intelligent, or if you're as stupid as my thumb. Some people out there in our nation don't have that and... If your mother breastfed you till you were 16, I say great! If your grandmother always greeted you with a wet, sloppy, open mouth kiss, super. I don't care! You're all bitches to me. Just so impressed with how Jason touched us, how gentle and tender and kind he was with Jake. I mean, he really got Jake to understand the importance of making my dinner. tell you how much Jason helped me. His books were perfect. They had cooking lessons, notes about what utensils, foods and spices to keep stocked in my kitchen, and amazing recipes like bend me over beef, uh, poke me pork, and artichoke the chicken. I can't say enough and I recommend this book to everyone. Plus it uh, well, it totally helped me get laid again. <laughs>